Hello friends, this is Aditya and you are watching Electric Vehicles India. Friends, in this video, let's learn about a new technology and that is hydrogen fuel cell technology. Nowadays, to reduce the pollution, we are shifting from IC vehicles to electric vehicles. Now, the main drawback of electric vehicles is its charging time. Usually, an electric vehicle takes 4 to 8 hours to get fully charged. By showing this reason, many people are quitting from buying an electric vehicle. The alternate solution to reduce the pollution is hydrogen fuel cell technology vehicles now let's see how an hydrogen fuel cell technology vehicle works usually a hydrogen fuel cell technology vehicle works similar to an electric vehicle normally in an electric vehicle we can see a motor and a battery similarly in hydrogen fuel cell vehicles also we can see a motor and an auxiliary battery along with both these you will also have a fuel cell and a hydrogen tank this fuel cell helps to convert hydrogen gas into electricity. Now let's see how this process works. The chemical formula of water is H2O. By separating oxygen from the water, we can extract hydrogen. That means if we separate oxygen from H2O, only hydrogen remains. And if we combine hydrogen plus oxygen, we get water and electricity. So this fuel cell which is used in the hydrogen fuel cell vehicle converts hydrogen into electricity. So a chemical reaction takes place here when hydrogen is pumped into this fuel cell with the help of cathode and anode which is present in this fuel cell separates electrons and protons from the hydrogen cell the separated electrons will produce electricity and it will charge the battery with the help of battery a electric motor works and the separated protons reacts with oxygen which enters the vehicle from outside to form water so by this chemical reaction hydrogen is transformed into electricity by producing water out of the car so like this electricity is produced in the car itself so this process helps the vehicle to produce electricity and to run the electric motor as the electric motor and battery will be present in this vehicle these vehicles are called hydrogen fuel cell electric vehicles FCEVs so till now everything is fine we are producing the electricity within the car and we are only emitting water out of it through which any kind of pollution won't be take place but why these hydrogen fuel cell technology vehicles are not yet popular and why they are not in our indian roads so let's find out the positives and negatives of this hydrogen fuel cell vehicles the main positive of this hydrogen fuel cell vehicle is we don't need to put an external electricity to run these cars as we do in the electric vehicles so it will create its own electricity with the help of this fuel cell by only giving hydrogen gas into the vehicle and the next positive point is its refueling time in the electric vehicles case it takes four to eight hours to get it fully charged whereas in the case of hydrogen vehicles it takes only five minutes to fully fill up that hydrogen tank and the next positive point is no pollution only water will be emitted after that chemical reaction from the hydrogen vehicle through which any kind of pollution won't be take place so these are some of the positive points of this hydrogen fuel cell vehicles now when it comes to negative the main negative point is its cost while compared to IC vehicles electric vehicles are somewhat expensive because they have electric motor and lithium-ion battery which is very expensive when it comes to hydrogen vehicles as it has an electric motor as well as an auxiliary battery along with this you will have a fuel cell and a hydrogen tank so by combining all these the cost of an hydrogen fuel cell vehicle will be more expensive than an electric vehicle and the next negative thing is the cost of setting up an hydrogen fuel station there are no hydrogen fuel stations available in india as of now and setting up a hydrogen fuel station cost more than that cost while setting up a electric charging station and hydrogen can't be extracted or exported from other countries to use in the vehicles and the other negative point is its refueling cost a hydrogen refueling cost equal to that of refueling a petrol or diesel vehicle the main advantage of this hydrogen fuel cell vehicle vehicles is there won't be any pollution but the running cost will be same as the running cost of a petrol or a diesel engines so these are some of the negative points considering which the hydrogen fuel cell vehicles couldn't able to make its way to the roads so this technology need to be developed more and in upcoming 10 years we are going to see only this hydrogen
storage and fuel cell technology vehicles on our Indian roads. The electric vehicles will be vanished in upcoming 20 years and all of us will be using these hydrogen fuel cell vehicles. So this is it for the video. This is all the information related to hydrogen fuel cell vehicles. And if you found the video helpful, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe Electric Vehicles India. Meet you in another interesting video. Until then, go green, go electric.